Imagine a machine so powerful it can crush a car like it's made of paper. This incredible force comes from a device that revolutionized industry, the hydraulic press. Today, we're exploring the fascinating story behind its invention. At its core, a hydraulic press harnesses the power of fluids under pressure. But before we dive into its creation, let's briefly understand the principle of hydraulics. Hydraulics is based on Pascal's law, which states that pressure applied to a confined fluid is transmitted equally in all directions. This simple yet profound concept laid the groundwork for one of the most important inventions in engineering history. The late 18th century was a time of great innovation. The Industrial Revolution was in full swing and inventors were constantly seeking ways to improve manufacturing processes. It was in this era of rapid technological advancement that the hydraulic press was born. Enter Joseph Brummer, an English engineer and inventor. Born in 1748, Brummer was a prolific innovator, holding patents for numerous inventions, including an improved water closet and a tamper-proof lock. However, his most significant contribution to the world of engineering came in 1795, when he patented the hydraulic press. Brahma's hydraulic press was ingeniously simple in its design. It consisted of two cylinders of different sizes connected by a pipe. The smaller cylinder acted as a pump, forcing fluid into the larger cylinder. The larger cylinder contained a piston that moved upward as fluid was pumped in, creating immense force. This design allowed for a small input force to be multiplied into a much larger output force following Pascal's principle. The impact of Brummer's invention was immense. The hydraulic press provided a means to apply enormous force in a controlled manner, something that was previously impossible or extremely difficult. This opened up new possibilities in manufacturing, allowing for the shaping and forming of metals that were previously too hard to work with using traditional methods. The applications of the hydraulic press quickly spread across various industries. In metalworking, it was used for forging, stamping and punching. In the textile industry, it was employed for baling cloth and cotton. Even the food industry found uses for it in extracting oils from seeds and pressing juice from fruits. As technology advanced, so did the hydraulic press. The basic principle remained the same but improvements in materials, sealing technology and control systems made hydraulic presses more efficient, powerful and versatile. Today, hydraulic presses are used in everything from automotive manufacturing to aerospace industries. They can exert forces ranging from a few tons to tens of thousands of tons, depending on their size and design. Modern hydraulic presses are often computer controlled, allowing for precise and repeatable operations. They're used in the production of everything from smartphone components to aircraft parts. The largest hydraulic presses in the world can exert forces of up to 100,000 tonnes, demonstrating just how far this technology has come since Brummer's original invention. The invention of the hydraulic press stands as a testament to human ingenuity and the power of applying scientific principles to solve practical problems. From its humble beginnings in Brahma's workshop to its current status as an indispensable tool in modern industry, the hydraulic press has truly shaped our world. It's a prime example of how a single invention can have far-reaching effects, influencing manufacturing, technology, and even our daily lives in ways we might not always recognize. The hydraulic press, born from the mind of Joseph Brahma over two centuries ago, continues to be a driving force in industry quite literally pressing us into the future.